Hello everyone, welcome back. Today I'm doing something a little bit different. I'm gonna take your recommendations that I've had on my last several videos and I'm gonna try three out today. Two of them are Roblox games and the other one is to use a vanilla stick on my dog. I have not done that yet. I've had several people tell me to do it. So we're gonna do that today. So the first portion of this video is a Roblox game. The second portion is the dog mod and I actually found something and really need your guys' help. And then lastly is another Roblox game and it had me cracking up so I really hope you stick around to watch. Okay, so here is our first game in Roblox and here is Roblox me, hello. It is called Wild Horse Islands and I guess the concept is that you go around and you catch wild horses and add them to your collection. Sounds kind of Pokemon-y to me, which I am a total fan of, I love Pokemon. I had no idea that Roblox even had horse games, so I'm really excited to see what it's all about and how it functions. And it looks like we start out with some basic equipment brush, hoof pick, and water. And it looks like we can equip either a lasso or a pickaxe. So let's go ahead and go talk to Nancy. And I think this must be her. Hello, Nancy, what do you need from me? So she has a wild horse on her island and I need to capture it. And to do that, I need a wooden lasso. That's really weird. Why would you need wood for a lasso? But I'm not gonna question it. We need to harvest some wood. So that kind of sounds very Minecrafty, right? You harvest resources and then you're crafting. So that's good. I like that aspect for sure. So we're gonna pickaxe this tree down, which is interesting to me. And we're gonna go ahead and go to the inventory and craft. And here's our wooden, and the chat is totally in the way. Okay, here's our wooden lasso. That's kind of weird. I mean, seriously, how would a wooden lasso work? Is that a thing? <laughs> Okay, so let's equip it and we're gonna go capture this horse. Wow, look at me go. I am just a regular pro at this. I'm coming for you, horse. You have no idea. You don't stand a chance against this awesome lassoing skills. Here we go. Why isn't it working? <laughs> I'm gonna get you, I promise. Oh, oops, I put it away. Okay, here we go. There, yeah, take that. All right. I captured him or her and he's broke to ride now so that's awesome totally convenient okay you know the horse doesn't look nearly as blocky as I would have expected for a Roblox game it's actually not bad to be honest so now we go back to the mainland and it's free I guess obtain through Ooh, breeding you can breed in this game oh that's neat Okay, let's collect more wood, I guess, because my lasso apparently was used up when I caught this horse, so I need to get another lasso. And we'll go over to this tree and grab more wood while we're here. I kind of like that my stats are above my head. Okay, so now we have a stone lasso. So it's almost like the tools in Minecraft, but it's like wood, then stone, and I'm assuming copper or something after that but I wonder what the difference is between the different lassos. Are one stronger? Ooh, there's a wild, ho ooh, an Appaloosa. Let's catch you. It takes 14 throws for the Appy. It's okay, we can do this. Just gonna run around like a crazy person. I will catch you. You will be mine. This has taken a really long time. <laughs> for some reason it turns red. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. It's like it won't throw the lasso and now I'm stuck on a tree. Okay, one more throw, one more. Oh my gosh, one more. Uh, seriously? Okay, last one, I got you. There we go. All right, cool, so now I have an Appaloosa and there's another horse right here. So that's convenient. I mean, we might as well catch it. Maybe the tip to this is to not run around and just kind of stand here, it seems easier. Okay, awesome. Oh my gosh, that person has a foal. I want a foal. That's so cute. I wonder how I get one. And where are my horses? Is there like a barn I go to? I mean, I've caught t three now. Oh, oh, they're just in my backpack. That's cool. Just kind of stuff them in there. So my Appaloosa is a mare. It shows when she was caught, her mood, her speed. Oh, there's all kinds of stats. Oh, that's neat. And this is a quarter horse. It looks like this one is a little bit faster. And she's 95% purebred. This one's 50. Okay. That's actually really cool. So that means you can just 
make all kinds of crosses then and have different um, different purities of the breed. So I wonder if the breeds actually change look though. I mean, if you cross say a quarter horse and an Arabian, is it gonna look like a half and half? For now, we're named the Appaloosa Sassy. I think it's a cute name. And then for this paint horse, because he is my first, obviously his name is Magic. And this quarter horse, is a mare and she looks exactly like a quarter horse I had when I was younger. So Moon is her name. And let's ride Sassy around for a little bit. I wanna see her cute blanket. Oh, and we have an English bridle, okay. Aw, it's cute. Her mane and tail's kinda nasty, but that's okay. Ooh, a carriage. That would be really fun to be pulled around in a carriage. That's something I wish Minecraft had, were carriages. That'd be a really neat addition, I think. And it looks like there's some horses for sale here. Oh, just suddenly changed. Okay. Ooh, a Percheron. What is this? Another quarter horse? And they all have their different stats and bloodlines. That's really neat. I like that whole incentive of catching and breeding. Ooh, I see this buckskin. Oh, he's so pretty. Oh, here we go. A breeding center. Oh, there's some babies. Oh, they're so cute. They're so cute. So you can just buy a full or Francine here. It looks like, oh, you okay. So this is where you breed your own horses. So I could breed Moon and Magic together. I don't have enough money, but, and it even shows the percentages of their crosses and their colors. Wow, I'm impressed. Oh, and I could build a cart could craft it, craft different saddles. Wow, a reigning saddle? This is actually really impressive, you guys. For being a Roblox game, I was not expecting much, but it seems like it has some detail to it. Ooh, look at that pretty horse. Okay, so it turns out you cannot craft ropes and you need a rope to craft the lasso. So you have to buy the ropes from this guy in the, in the town. So I can only afford one but I built my lasso and I'm gonna catch this really pretty horse. I love the mane and coat color. It's really pretty together. I'm assuming it's a quarter horse because it seems like most of the horses around here are either quarter horses or Appaloosas. One more rope throw, if I can aim it. There we go. Awesome. Got ourselves a really pretty quarter horse. Okay, so that was a little snippet of Wild Horse Island. I was actually pretty impressed. I could see how it would be addicting to go around and try and collect as many as you can and then breed different variations. So I completely understand the draw to this little game. Okay, so now that we got the Roblox game out, we're gonna move on to the second plan of this video and that is to check out the full extent of the dog mod. I had multiple people in my other videos say, hey, use a vanilla stick on your dog and see what happens. So I'm finally gonna do that and I'm really hoping for the best. Hopefully there's more customization options for my dog so I can have him not just look like a normal wolf and maybe be able to do some cool stuff. I don't know, we're gonna find out right now. All right, Archie, here we go. Let's do it. Oh, wow, there's all kinds of stuff. So I guess you can spec your dog to have different talents. Oh, it's called doggy talents. <laughs> I'm a little bit slow. Okay, it makes sense. So you can put him in like attack mode. That's neat. I mean, it's not gonna help me much because I don't have any oh no my archie is a girl <laughs> i'm so sorry oh well that's okay a wolf mount are you serious you can ride your dog that would look so silly it allows you to ride your dog in water a shepherd dog yes the comment mentioned this you can actually turn your dog into a shepherd that will herd sheep and stuff which is awesome for when i'm doing my you know ranch role play stuff I absolutely need a shepherd. This is so neat. I really love all these different things. And then check this out. I can change his skin. So he's not just a normal wolf. I can make him look, where did he go? I was she, she, sorry, she. Oh, look at this bulldog. Oh my gosh, that's really cute. Okay, so let's look at other skins. Stop running away, just hold still. I want to, oh my gosh, it's a pug. Oh, that's cute. Is this like a husky? Wow, I had no idea that these were options. No wonder you guys were telling me to use the stick. Like I should have done this so long ago. I don't know what kind of breed that is. It's cute though. Um, 
I want to try and pick a skin. Oh, that's like a fox. Pick a skin that looks the closest to my real life dog. None of these really match super good, but I'm going to find one that's kind of decent. And then eventually I'm going to get myself a shepherd. All right, so this is the skin I picked for Archie and then check out these bones. So I use this big bone and look at him, he's massive. He's like a dire wolf at this point. And then this small bone, look at how cute this is. I can seriously make a whole litter of puppies and then select my puppy. Oh, I love this so much. So let's make him giant again. And then I am absolutely going to check out this uh, wolf mount stat because that just seems so silly. All right. So let's go ahead and give you your wolf mount talent and let's go for a ride. Going out in Minecraft with this dog in a survival world would be so much fun, especially if you give them all these stats. They're just going around destroying all the monsters. All right, here we go. Oh my gosh, this is so funny. <laughs> what? Look at his tail. Wow. That's hilarious. Let's look at from the front. I sit on him nice and centered, though. I mean, he looks so happy. Oh my gosh. Wait, back up. There is a fox. He is stuck in the bush. Oh my gosh. We are absolutely going to catch this fox. Oh, and the poor guy's stuck too. That's actually really sad. Oh, he can't get away. Okay, Mr. Fox, I'm going to help you. Just one second. Uh, clear that bush. Okay. Oh, yes, I got him. Oh, the poor thing. I wonder how long he was stuck here. Getting kind of distracted, but I can't leave him stuck in a bush. And honestly, I really want a pet fox. <laughs> so it's really convenient. I guess I'll just place him in this first stall. I don't know really where else to put him. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he can't get out. I don't think there's any holes or anything. How do I tame him? I don't think I've ever tamed a fox. Do they eat like fish? Um, I don't think it's fish. What about chicken? I know that if they have a live chicken, they'll chase it and eat it. But I don't know how to tame it. Okay, mm he's not eating it. Maybe a cooked chicken? I mean, I wouldn't want to eat raw chicken. Okay, not chicken. I don't know what to feed you, I'm sorry. All right, so I looked it up. Apparently you feed them sweet berries, but you can't tame an adult fox outright. You have to have a second fox breed them and then the baby will be your pet I think so we obviously don't have a second fox so this guy is just gonna have to hang out here until I find myself another one so I'm gonna have to do that go out in the forest and hunt for another fox in the meantime though if you guys want to come up with a name for this little guy absolutely be my guest I will take recommendations and come up or pick one I guess and go ahead and call him that so we're gonna have him stick around for a while that's so weird I can't believe I happened to just see him stuck there. All right, so that was the doggy mod. Thank you so much for recommending me to use the stick. I love how Archie looks and he's back to his normal size. I'm not gonna be riding him around or anything like that. I just wanted to test it. So now for the last portion of the video, we're gonna check out the last Roblox game called Horse Valley. So here's Horse Valley, okay. Instantly there are giant arrows. Oh, I have my own stall, that's so cute. I can pick the hooves and brush. Oh, and there goes another rider. Okay. Well, at least the arrows are extremely obvious on where to go. You can't get lost. Ooh, that person looks like they've played a while. Okay, so I guess I'm going to buy this horse. My very first horse. Oh, that's a kind of a neat animation. What is this screen overlay? I guess it really wants me to push this question mark, so I'll go ahead and do that. Train your horse in barrel racing. Oh, fun, barrel racing. Okay, I'm totally down for that. All right, let's go. Oh my gosh, my poor horse. She is missing half of her butt and part of her leg. Oh no, oh no, oh, oh poor thing. You don't have half a butt, I'm so sorry. See, this blockiness is kind of what I was expecting on the other Roblox game. A lot more chiseled, I guess. It kind of reminds me of Legos. Oh, my gosh, that's extremely distracting. I'm trying to run a pattern here and then the screen is just all in my face. Okay, so I guess we're gonna do pole bending next. So the barrel racing leveled my swiftness. Pole bending seems to be leveling my agility. 
So you just take your horses on these different courses and continue to horses courses. Ah, uh, okay. Anyways, this is actually a lot harder than it looks. I think I'd be better off just trotting this pattern at this point. Yeah, it, my horse cannot turn very sharp at all. So we'll just trot it. Oh my gosh. Whoops. Try again. Oh, seriously? Ugh. Okay, so I got this leveled decently enough, I think. So we're going to move on to the next pen, which is show jumping. It's going to be interesting. I don't know where to start. I guess it doesn't really matter. There doesn't seem to be a course of any of any kind. Okay. Uh, it's kind of hard to tell when I'm successful. I guess whenever I get the point, because sometimes my screen like right there just flashes red. I guess I hit the pole. Okay, so this is leveling up my strength. It's actually really fast to level. I mean, it doesn't take very long. Yes, I want this gone. Oh no, I absolutely don't want to buy anything. There's so many pop-ups. Oh my gosh. Yes, okay. It's like I'm just trying to level my horse here and you keep popping up all these things in my face. And next is the round pen. So it looks like with this one, just gonna kind of collect the stars all in a circle, which I mean is easy enough. You don't have to time jumps or anything. It just kind of run around or trot around rather. Your horse has unlocked a new dressage. Oh, dressage too? Whoa, Amber, you're looking a little rough there. All right. Oh no. My horse's knees bend backwards and he just pooped himself. Oh, that looks really weird. I'm uncomfortable. Very uncomfortable. Okay, let's pick up this poop. It's a quest now. All right, now I have one manure. Okay, Amber, what is this? So we have some dressage moves. We have rearing, sliding stop, a leg yield. Really? This little Roblox game has these different dressage moves and let's look at another big horse game. Star Stable, really? Anyways, let's go practice this rear. Ready, go. Hey, that's not too bad looking. I mean, my rider even, no, I don't wanna race. No, thank you. The rider kind of even leans forward. So if, no, I don't wanna race all these pop-ups, seriously. So I, I was trying to figure out why I can't do these other moves and I don't have high enough level for these different stats. So it makes sense. But now my horse is thirsty. So we're gonna have to get him or her some water. Oh, there's like emotes. That's neat. Um, here's your water. How do I give it to you? I keep pushing escape and it keeps bringing up that menu. Okay, she's, or she, he, oh, it's a mare. She is drinking. Okay, complete. And now she is hungry. So we gotta go get her some hay. So the hay is way out in this field. I did was not expecting that. Ooh, a Clydesdale. Expensive though. And a thoroughbred. How come all these horses are missing a leg? It's like a weird texture thing. Here's your hay. Oh, very nice. And then my next quest tells me to go take the poop over here. So I guess I'll do that real fast. Um, compost. Ooh, I get money. So poop is money. Okay, I will make sure to pick up all the poops. An Andalusian. Wow, that's really expensive, my goodness. Oh, free money, free money. Pick it up. Yes. Can't leave that lion around. Look how cute this is. So across the map, I saw that there was a bunch of buildings and this is a supermarket. Cute backpack and fireworks. And this is seeds. Oh, so you can plant a garden then. And look at this, a pizza place, an ice cream shop. And in the distance, there's a Ferris wheel. I wonder if I can ride it. Okay, we're gonna do this. Oh, dang. Okay, we can't ride it. My horse and I were totally gonna ride this together. Oh well, look at this, watch. <laughs> that looks hilarious. That's really funny. Oh wow, these are player farms. <gasps> That's so awesome. Honestly, you guys, this is the kind of setup I am working on for my Minecraft server. Oh, free money. Who's just lying this change, just leaving it here? Like it's not that hard to pick it up and cash it in. I wanna try the sliding stop real fast cause I got enough swiftness to do it. Oh, that's neat. I mean, it's not great, but it's not bad. I mean, at least it's in the game. No, I do not wanna race. Ugh, I would so get beat so bad. 
Let's try and pick the hooves. Oh, I kind of like this animation. It's not half bad, honestly. Let's brush you. This is the kind of animations we need in Minecraft. Give you a nice bath. Okay, good night. So that was it. That's everything that I have to show you today. Thank you for the recommendations. I really had a lot of fun with this. I'm impressed by these Roblox games. I really am. And I'm so happy about Archie, my dog, being more like Archie, my dog. So again, thank you so much for your recommendations. If you do have any more, please let me know in the comments. I am absolutely down to try whatever you guys recommend to me. Come up with a name for my fox. And if you are new to the channel, please consider subscribing. I would absolutely love to have you. Until next time, bye guys.